Hey Tom, how's it going? My name is Paul. I'm with East Wind SEO. Uh, I've partnered up with Connected SEO to bring you this video showing you some tips on how to improve your online presence. Uh, you spoke with Nathan earlier about this video. I'm going to go ahead and jump right into it. Um, I'm going to go over three things that are going to help improve traffic to your website and that's going to be content citations and backlinks. I have your website pulled up right here. Um, you know, overall, it's a well put together website. It's a nice looking website. Uh, you have your phone number, email, social links right up here. Um, you do have a chat, which is awesome. Um, you know, nice looking pictures. I would definitely say, you know, you are lacking content. Um, content is important, you know, for being found on Google search results. And the reason for that is, you know, Google loves to crawl your website. They're going to crawl your website. They're going to look through all your content. And the more keywords that you have within your content that are relevant to what it is you do um, and where it is you offer these services and, you know, all that stuff, it's going to tell Google about your business. It's going to help them determine where to place you on the Google search results that are relevant to your business. Same thing, you know, when people search those keywords in Google you know, you are going to end up showing up more often for those keywords when you have them within your content because you're going to be more relevant to the searches. And so a keyword is going to be anything that somebody puts in the Google, you know, when they search for a product or a service. So that is my tips on content. 1,500 words gives you plenty of room to put in those buyer intent keywords. Um, and then I went ahead and just did a search uh, for paving companies in Sacramento and the first thing you're going to see are ads so ads are a great way to get in front of people you know you can get your business in front of people a lot of different ways online a really good way to do that is with ads because ads allow you to target a specific audience and that's going to help you get in front of the people that you think are more likely you know to go with uh, your services or products or anything like that so you can definitely see some really good results from a well-placed um, ad on Google or Facebook or anything like that. Uh, moving on down, we have the Google search or the Google map pack. This is gonna be the top three right here. These guys see a good amount of business just from showing up in this top three. Um, and that's your Google business profile. What you wanna do to get in that top three is you wanna have it filled out as much and as accurately as possible with all of your information, your business information. Then you wanna put all of that into um, online directories um so an online directory is going to be anything like yelp or yellow pages or angie's list you know anything like that. there are hundreds of online directories to get your business into and you want to get citations back from those um directories right so basically the more um you know citations you have the more chances you have of showing up at this top three you want to basically out rank or outdo your um competition in the number of citations that you're getting back um, as we move down we have the organic search results you're going to see some you know these are directories up here it looks like not too worried about them you want to focus on directing you know your direct competition um so as we can see, these guys right here look, I mean, if these guys were your direct competition, you want to work on, you know, outranking them, coming up above them, right? Um, so if we take a look, and the way I do that, at a tool that I use called AREFs, um, this is just, just going to show me, you know, how a website is performing. Uh, it gives me an idea of keywords, backlinks that they're using, you know, it gives me a good roadmap um, on how I'm going to go about, go about making a strategy on outranking them. Um, so I have, I threw you guys in right there and we can see that, you know, you guys are doing okay with, you got 188 backlinks. You are being shown for 31 organic keywords. You're getting a little bit of traffic. So this UR and DR here are two important numbers that you want to pay attention to. Um, the UR being a, trust rating or how trustworthy your your website is according to Google, uh, the DR being power rating or how powerful your website is. Um, these two numbers generally you want to try and keep them within close ratio to each other while also uh, you know getting them up as high as possible and that is you know with your backlinks. Um, 
A backlink is going to be anything that links back to your website from an outside source, right? Whether it be another website or another comment or a comment blog or something like that. The goal is to get quality backlinks linking back to your website. So by quality backlinks, I mean link backlinks that are coming from referring domains that are relevant to your service industry. You don't want random websites linking back to you because that could potentially come across as spammy in Google's eyes. You know, it's going to hurt your numbers. Uh, it's going to affect your rankings and so on right so we remember to get quality backlinks um so if we take a look at these guys we can see the difference here they're getting a ton of traffic um they have a ton of backlinks they're being shown for a lot of keywords right so one way to do this is you know go through their backlink profile whatever backlinks are working for them are most likely going to work for you guys as well um so you could definitely go out and find those backlinks um, <clears throat> same with organic keywords. You can definitely use some keywords that are working for them. They can definitely work for you as well. Um, that's why I stress the importance of having that content on your homepage because it allows you to be found uh, for you know those keywords and allows you to show up a lot more often within Google search results, right? And that's only going to bring you guys more business. It's going to bring you more traffic. Um, and that's what we're here to do, right? Increase business by use of your online presence. Um, so that is all the information I have. I hope these tips were helpful. You definitely can implement them yourself. Um, start seeing some results from that. You can always reach out to us as well for more information. Uh, I will link our information in this video as well as the email I sent out. So thank you again for checking out this video. We really do appreciate you taking the time to take a look at it. And go ahead and have yourself a wonderful rest of your day.